So why did God... Hey, let's, let's read the passage. So Malachi chapter 3, starting in verse 6. I, the Lord, do not change. So you, the descendants of Jacob, are not destroyed. Ever since the time of your ancestors, you have turned away from my decrees and have not kept them. Return to me, and I will return to you, says the Lord Almighty. But you ask, how are we to return? And the Lord says, will a mere mortal rob God? Yet you rob me. But you ask, how are we robbing you? In tithes and offerings, you are under a curse. Your whole nation, because you are robbing me. Bring the whole tithe into the storehouse, that there may be food in my house. Test me in this, says the Lord Almighty, and see if I will not throw open the floodgates of heaven and pour out so much blessing that there will not be room enough to store it. I will prevent pests from devouring your crops, and the vines in your fields will not drop their fruit before it is ripe, says the Lord Almighty. Then all the nations will call you blessed, for yours will be a delightful land, says the Lord Almighty. So Proverbs 3, 9 to 10 says, Honor the Lord with your wealth, with the first fruits of all your crops. Then your barns will be filled to overflowing, and your vats will brim over with new wine. So again, I ask the question, why did God set this tithe at 10%? Now, by the way, how much money does the government want from you? I, every, yeah, everything you have. I don't know. Let's go with 30 to 40 percent. How about Social Security? How much, does, how much do they want between what your employer pays on your behalf and what you pay? Or if you're self-employed, you already know that amount, which is 15 percent. So I think God set it at 10 percent because and, and gave it to us as a principle, because if God didn't, I would be very frustrated with verses like this, honor the Lord with your wealth, if you don't know what that is. When I go to a restaurant, I kind of like that they have on the slip kind of the proper amount to tip your waiter or waitress. And it's, it's gone up. 40 years ago, what was it? What was the tip 40 years ago? 10%. What is it today? 20 and I notice on my bill, they'll put 18, 20, and 22. Like they're already stretching us. So I'm like, uh-oh, I know where this is going. So, but I like, I like that it gives me, because if, if they just said, hey, honor your waiter or waitress. You decide what you want to give. I'd be frustrated because I'd be like, I don't know, we had a $50 meal. Should I give a dollar? Should I give 50? I, I, I'm frustrated. I want to know. When I go to the barber, what, tell me what should I be tipping? For my cancer doctor's appointment, it's down at the Hillman Center in Pittsburgh. You have to valet park your car. So you don't have a choice. So when we were checking out, I'm talking to the woman taking our money, and there's all these college students that park your car. So I'm like, hey, what, what is expected? What's the tip? And, you know, at first she was like, oh, just give whatever you want. And I'm like, don't, oh, I don't like that. I, tell me what kind of, tell me, give me a range. So she gave me the range, and I'm like, okay. So, and I think we hit the top. But I want to know. So... I think God needs to be honored. If, if he didn't give the 10%, there are some people that would only give 1%. In fact, 80% of born-again Christians only give 1% to the Lord. Okay? And you have to decide if you believe that's honoring the Lord. So let's see, if I make $100,000, I'm going to give God $1,000, and I'm going to keep 99000 for myself. If I make 200,000, I'm going to give God 2,000 and I'm going to keep 198,000 for myself. You have to decide if that's honoring to God or not. I don't know. That's basically throwing in five, ten dollars a week. You make hundred thousand dollars, you give God five dollars a week. Okay, you. But at the other, the other extreme would be if, if I first got saved, I really felt God was my partner. 
And I'd be like, okay, God's my partner. He died for me. How, how much, maybe he wants to be a partner in, my, in everything I do. And maybe it has to be 50-50. So everything I bring, God's my partner. He gets 50%. That would really honor him. But God is like, no, 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 that's 10%. That's not, it's not a, it's not five bucks a week, but I'm not hitting you like the government's going to hit you. Um, so I, I like that God gave the amount.